Stan Van Gundy's Josh Smith gamble has paid off so far for the Detroit Pistons, but we're about to see exactly what they have in them. They play at the Spurs, at the Mavericks, and against the Hawks and Nets this week, which will be a good chance to see how far this team can go. Point guard Brandon Jennings and power forward Greg Monroe have looked reinvigorated without the shot-happy Smith in the picture. Who's the best team in the East? Well, we might get a little bit of a clearer picture on Friday night when the Bulls play at the Wizards. The Hawks and the Raptors and the Wizards and the Bulls, they're all kind of fighting for that top spot right now. LeBron's Cavaliers certainly have not established themselves in that group. So that's left the door open for the Bulls, who are the East's most talented and deepest team, and the Wizards, who might be right behind them in those categories. On a Clippers team that lacks depth, shooting, and wing play, J.J. Redick kind of gets a little underrated. The shooting guard and Duke legend has become a very valuable offensive player, but also carries his own on defense. Just as the Pistons are playing better without Josh Smith, the Houston Rockets have taken a little bit of a decline lately. One issue is, should Smith be starting? I don't know. I think he adds a lot to what they need in the bench rather than putting him in the starting lineup with James Harden, Trevor Ariza, and Dwight Howard, Smith could be a great factor on a bench that needs a playmaker and doesn't really have an identity yet. Well, it appears people are finally taking the Atlanta Hawks seriously. And all it took was winning 18 of their last 20 entering the week. The Hawks have a true system built off of what the Spurs are doing in San Antonio, which is where they got coach and now GM Mike Budenholzer. Skeptics still might doubt them for the playoffs, but the Hawks proved last season that they have the ingredients to make a decent run when they pushed the number one seed Indiana Pacers to seven games in the first round.